Hey everyone, welcome back to another Godzilla battling video and today we are going over the new offers in the store and it is also worth mentioning that there is a boosted G token campaign so we will be able to earn double G tokens by playing the game. Uh, this is pretty solid, I mean we love double coins so can't get enough of the gems or not the gems, the tokens, we need them for everything in this game, right? Also, it ends on March 13th, which leads me to believe All-Star Battles on the 14th. I believe we might have had also confirmation of that date prior. I don't remember, so I'm just going to go ahead and say it now that for the 14th is probably All-Star Battle. Uh, and the leader is Kiryu. We do know the leader is going to be Kiryu. But with that being said, let's take a look at the store because there's three offers I want to talk about. Two of them are going to be really quick. One of them I'm going to rant about for a second. So we're going to go over here. The first new offer is this one. Pretty standard run-of-the-mill offer. Pretty free to play friendly, 10,000 tokens for 600 gems. This is a good deal because they normally offer 10,000 tokens on their own for 800 gems, which is not a good deal. With this, you also get a poster for 600. Good deal if you have 600 gems and you need tokens. This is the best way to get them. We're skipping this Discovery Banquet for a second because I want to go down to here. This three star Discovery Pickup Jet Jaguar map is just the uh regular maps for the two star or not for the two stars for the 2000 gems but just now available like every day so only three battle pieces are guaranteed when a four star unit is discovered that unit will uh be jet jaguar so you have a three percent chance to discover a four star but it's going to be jet jaguar okay so it's not exactly like the 2000 bundle for uh godzilla earth which i believe is the scorched earth expedition map because it has a chance to find other four stars in it. This Jet Jaguar one only has a chance for Jet Jaguar, but you have to pull the four star first. So not a great deal. If you want Jet Jaguar, this is probably your best way to get him. Uh, the Terrestrious one was offered before this, so it looks like they're going to cycle these guys out maybe every two weeks to get a different map. So these look like they're going to be probably the best ways to get a specific piece. We just don't know the rotation order or anything like that, but it's 2000 gems for a 3% chance. I still don't think it's a great deal. It is better, though, than the regular 2,000 gem offers, though. For sure. Like, by a mile, because it's guaranteed. But it's still a little sketch, because there's only a 3% chance. This is the one I want to talk about. I do not like this offer. You pay 23 US for 500 gems, where we already have a bundle that's very similar to this. For $22, you're going to get 3,000 some odd gems. And 10,000 coins that you're getting for the 600 uh, gems, which is, like, less than 10 bucks. So... Let's take a look at what this offers you. So you have until March 13th to get it. You're going to get the Banquet Hall Expedition have four kinds of battle pieces. So you're going to be able to get a one star from this, a two star from this, a three star from this, or a four star from this. 500 G stones and 10,000 G tokens. One of the following four star battle pieces discovered by searching the four star gold Banquet Hall Expedition. So I am thinking that you are guaranteed one of the four stars. But look at the list of four stars they have. Mothra Larva, Biollante, Jet Jaguar, King Ghidorah, Mothra Leo Rodan, and Kiryu. The only ones in here that I would want to get is Biollante and Kiryu. Mothra, maybe. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of them. Out of seven of them, only three of them are even remotely worth using right now. Uh, yeah, Kiryu, King Ghidorah, and... Bi oh, I'm sorry, King Ghidorah is pretty good too. So King Ghidorah, Bio, Biollante, Mothra. Like, I got about half. Two of the three-star battle piece unlocked by Arena Rank 36 will appear in the three-star Banquet Hall Expedition map. Three of the two-star battle pieces unlocked by Arena Rank 36 will appear. Uh, four of the one-star battle pieces unlocked by Arena Rank will appear. The lottery prob probability within each rarity is equal. Packs may be sold again later. So it looks like you buy this. You're going to get a one-star map, and that's going to give you a bunch of one-stars. Two-star map going to give you a bunch of two-stars. Three-star map is going to give you a bunch of three-stars. And the four-star map guaranteed for one of these four-stars. I do not like this offer. I think that the four star offerings are really like terrible. They didn't even bother to include Batra or Space Godzilla or Terrestris or um, Burning or 1954 or Gigan 04. Like they, they omitted a bunch of four stars from this that are actually really, really solid. So you have you have a chance of getting like Hiryu, King Ghidorah, and Bio or a chance of getting like Jet Jaguar or Rodan, which are not really being too used right now. If you are a brand, brand, brand new player and you are looking to whale, this could get you a jump start in your deck. This is, you know, if you're rank one, this will get you pieces that you couldn't unlock until, you know, around rank 36. And it'll give you a lot of them, right? So you have an early advantage, but 
man, the four star offerings are not that great. And for the cost, for the price of this whole thing, I wouldn't, I wouldn't do it. And even whales, you know, whales will probably scoop this up because they just buy everything in the game. I wouldn't even buy this. I wouldn't even touch this. This just looks like a money sink. But that's my thoughts on it. So with that being said, this is probably one of the worst offers I've ever seen. But it, I mean, it could be helpful. I just don't recommend spending the money. But with that being said, thank you all so much for watching. I will catch you all on the next one. Bye-bye.